Namaste my fellow strikers, Holy Materia here, back with another Shinobi Striker video. Today we're going to be talking about the Ashiki update and the new map and everything that's coming soon. So let's get right into it. Okay, so first big shout out to Zeno Martinez and Despair for showing me all these new images. So we've got new images of the new cloud map. We got the full descriptions of all of Ashiki's moves. We got a whole bunch of stuff to talk about. So this is some hype stuff. So let's get right into it. Okay, so first let's just go over Ashiki's moves. So we have the full breakdowns and screenshots and everything so so the official name of the first ninjutsu is hidden jutsu sukuna hikona so this one has a 22 second cooldown and has a two in power and a two in range it says user shrinks enemy projectiles instantly nullifying them transportation ninjutsu activated for user upon enemy close range attacks or ninjutsu added input generates a column at enemy location causing damage reducing speed and increasing ninjutsu and substitution cooldown okay so yeah this looks crazy so it has multiple parts that give them all kinds of debuffs so you can use this to to stop ninjutsu from hitting you and it also acts as a counter and then you can do another thing and then attack opponents and it looks like it's not going to be focused on damage but more about all those debuffs and those are some pretty crucial debuffs too so then the next one the next jutsu is just called karma it's got a 15 second cooldown a two in power and a one in range uh, it says etch karma onto a single enemy dealing damage additional input grants the user increased attack speed and tracking ability user also automatically gets behind target and deals damage so this one is going to act like a teleportation thing where you can attack somebody but this is crazy though that it increases the attack tracking speed so this is almost like a de defense oborogaruma so this might be overpowered because making defense type so fast is kind of a crazy idea so some of this stuff looks like it could really be meta changing like i don't i don't see how this wouldn't change the game man this is kind of crazy and then for the ultimate it's called hidden jutsu vast dark heavens so it has a four in power and a one in duration so this might be like the defense ultimate that people have been waiting for that does a lot of damage because it looks like it will probably one shot some people all right, so the jutsu that rains gigantic boulders down on the enemy. Upon impact, the boulders also send out shockwave damage to surrounding enemies, temporarily blocking chakra detection and disabling lock-on and status checks. So I don't know what the chakra detection is, but so then you can't, you, when you get hit by the shockwave, you can't lock on to people and you can't, maybe your UI goes away. But I don't know what, what the chakra detection would be. That sounds really interesting. So yeah, man, these moves look crazy. And we know that he's also coming with the ninja tool, but we don't have any new information on that yet. So yeah, this Ashiki DLC is looking way better than I thought it was going to be <laughs> now that we see like the official descriptions. And now let's look at the cloud map, man, because these images look insane. So we got the full map layout, yeah the way it's laid out and now it's symmetrical pretty much. Yeah it looks like it's com completely symmetrical, one side is just flipped. And then we have some screenshots of like the different times of day, we got the daytime, evening, and then night. And from the night image it looks like the map won't have pitfalls because I can't imagine that the pitfalls are that close to the rest of the, the map. So it looks like there's some kind of water on the ground, sort of like in the rain village map. So. That would be amazing if they took the if they found a way to take the pitfalls out of the cloud map because that was the that was the biggest pitfall map. Or that map had the most areas with pitfalls, I should say. So yeah, man, this this update is looking as hype as all the updates that we've gotten in season five. Like season five has been a big dub. The devs are going hard, man. <laughs> like this 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 is looking amazing. I'm I'm hyped, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, man, the devs are really stepping up. It looks like they're at least trying to let defense types hang in there with attack types. Range is still down bad but besides that this season five has just been amazing man it's been incredible so yeah let me know what you guys think of all this because we, these images are are like leaked that means that ashiki is almost definitely coming out tomorrow so look forward to that it's not 100 percent confirmed but i'd be really surprised if he didn't drop tomorrow so yeah i'll definitely be streaming and keeping you guys up to date with gameplay of the new ashiki dlc and the new cloud map and everything so stick around for more content. Be sure to like the video and subscribe if you want to see more. I'll see you guys in the next one. Everybody stay safe out there. Peace and love.